today we are reading Everybody in the Red Brick Building by Anne Winter, published by Harper Collins. And we are learning how one baby waking up in the middle of the night and making a loud noise sets off a chain reaction in this apartment building where everybody wakes up and makes their own noise until the grown-ups get involved. I hope you enjoy. Everybody in the Red Brick Building by Anne Winter. Everybody in the Red Brick Building was asleep. Until baby Izzy sat up in her crib and howled. Wah! Woken up by a wah! Rehan tiptoed out of bed to check on his parrot. Prak, wake up! Woken up by a wah! And a rock, wake up! Benny pulled Cairo and Miles from their sleeping bags and challenged them to a game of flashlight tag. Pitter patter stomp! Woken up by a wah and a rock, wake up at a pitter patter stomp. Natalia dropped from her bunk to launch her brand new light up rocket. Shh. Woken up by a wah, a rock, wake up, a pitter patter stomp, and a shh. Pepper bounded down from her perch, dashed across the lawn, and leapt onto a car. Whee! Oh. Rock, wake up, pitter patter stomp, shh. Whee! Oh. Rock, good night, click, quiet now, beep. Back on her perch, Pepper curled up tight and listened to the shh of the street sweeper. Back in her bunk, Natalia named the stars and listened to the shh and the plunk, plunk of the falling acorns. Back in their sleeping bags, Cairo, Benny, and Miles closed their eyes and listened to the shh, the plank, plank, and the ding, ding of the wind chimes. Back in his bed, Rayhan burrowed under his covers and listened to the shh, the plonk, plonk, the ting, ting, and the cheep, cheep of his parrot. Back in her mother's arms, baby Izzy snuggled close and listened to the shh, the plank, plonk, the ting, ting, the ship, ship, and the pum, 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 pum of her mother's heartbeat. Until everybody in the red brick building was asleep. You have been listening to Everybody in the Red Brick Building by Ann Winter.